Inside this mass general operating room, a medical milestone. For the first time, a team of doctors transplanted a genetically modified pig kidney into a 62-year-old man whose previously donated kidney failed and was struggling on dialysis. It's historical. Dr. Leo Riella first suggested a pig kidney, the... knowing the patient could not wait for a human one. Of the 100,000 people in the U.S. on transplant waiting lists, the vast majority need kidneys. Most of our patients have to wait for an organ from the deceased donor list. And unfortunately, if they have to stay years on dialysis, that means their health is going to continue to deteriorate. Our immune systems typically reject foreign tissue. But through cutting-edge CRISPR technology from eGenesis, this pig kidney had 69 genomic edits to improve compatibility and to reduce the risk of infection from viruses. Still, animal to human transplants are riddled with unknowns, including how long the pig kidney will last. But so far, the patient's nephrologist says the results appear promising. He has a, the surgery on Saturday, and we think he's on track for discharge this coming Saturday. So within a week? Within a week. In a statement, the patient said, I saw it not only as a way to help me, but a way to provide hope for the thousands of people who need a transplant to survive. We need a permanent solution. And dialysis was never made to be a permanent solution. Could it essentially make dialysis obsolete? That's our goal. Emily Iketa, NBC News, Boston. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.